Welcome Earthlings, I have had a lot of people asking me for another workout video, so here you go. All right, we are getting warmed up with some pull-ups. I do not have a set number of reps that I do for this. Uh, it really just depends on how I'm feeling that day. Some days I'll be over 20, some days I'll be around 10. Uh, that is Eddie's finger. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, uh, just do enough where you really start to feel it. Don't go to failure or anything. Uh, yeah, just depends on how you feel. All right, here is the rest of Eddie. Uh, he's my boy, he helps me fill my workout, so thanks to you for that. Uh, look at that form, man. Look at how slow he's going. All right, after the pull-ups, we did the lat push down, four sets, eight to 12 reps, nothing special. Um, I really love doing this exercise, especially kind of as a warm-up as well, just because it really helps me stretch out the lats. Next, we have cable rows, same thing, four sets, eight to 12 reps. Uh, I know my form doesn't look the best on this, but I'm telling you guys, I feel great when I do it, so I'm just going off of that. Also, a lot of people wanted to know what I do to get my biceps so big. This is it, guys. I don't train my arms. Uh, they just get pumped up for my back workouts. After the cable rows, we move to shrugs. Same thing, four sets, eight to 12 reps. Uh, some days I do deadlifts at the shrug machine and some days I just do the shrugs, so this was obviously a shrug day. And I don't like doing free weight deadlifts here, just because the plates are angled, and if they're not aligned, then the bar will roll all over the place. All right, next we have reverse flies. You guessed it, four sets, eight to 12 reps. Um, I know a lot of people like doing this exercise on shoulder days or push days. I do not, uh, I prefer to work it in with my back. And for my shoulders on my push days, I usually work the side and front delt along with my chest. Real quick guys, I'm not hating, but do not be like the guy on the left. He's just flying through it. You need to push yourself. After the reverse flies, I move to the machine rows for a five set pyramid. Uh, this time I'm using the high row. Most of the time I use the one to the left that those two guys are on, uh, but it was taken, so I just did this. Uh, yeah, five set pyramid. I'll start with two plates and then I'll go up to three then four and then back down to three and back down to two and I don't have a set number of reps for these I usually just go until I'm pretty close to failure here's my boy Eddie again getting it done on the high rows and oh well hello again all right guys we are on my finisher this is what I do after every back workout I love it it just really helps to destroy your back get a crazy pump so we got lat pull down, push down, super set. Uh, we do three of those until near failure. And then the last one, we just keep going and going until we can't anymore. So here I am moving back to the push down. Uh, you guys saw me doing this earlier. Same thing, just going a little bit lighter and obviously I am a lot sweatier. Now I'm pretty sure this was actually my last set. So you guys are gonna watch me suffer a little. Uh, right here, you're gonna see me take the weights down. Uh, don't be afraid to move like 40 pounds. It all depends on how you're feeling. And this is a really hard exercise. You are not gonna be moving a ton of weight on this one. All right, you guys, that is it for my pull day workout. Uh, like I said, I do not train my arms, but if you do want your arms to get bigger, then my go-to exercises would be hammer curls and reverse curls just because they also work out your forearms. All right guys, that's the video. If you liked it, please let me know with a thumbs up. Subscribe if you wanna see more. You can buy my shirt at straightveg.com. Uh, if you don't wanna do that, you can still support me by following me on social media. All the links are in the description. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate your support. Go Veg!